Hello, thank you for watching Big Jug Trekker Girls channel. Uh, today, I wanted to talk about the uh, new law that came in effect on February 7th. And um, I'm just making this video to warn people, um, my fellow friends, that if you got your permit before February 7th, you need to be careful with the um, attempts that you use to take your test at the DMV because after February 7th, if you fail your test three times, then you will have to retake your whole course again. Um, you ask yourself, how is that possible? Well, when you get your permit um, before February 7th, you did not have to have any type of uh, like training at a school and the school was not like registered um, with the DMV or anything. You can basically take your father's truck or your uh, uncle's truck or whoever, a friend's truck of yours and go to the DMV and practice. So due to the new law, they have stopped that. And what you do need is 15 hours of minimum over the road training. Um, depending on what school you enroll in, that can be a lot of money. 15 hours doesn't sound like too much, but it is. In the trucking world, it's about $125 to $150 an hour. Um, so if you times 150 times 15, it's going to be over $2,000 for 15 hours of training. Um, so once you take your test, if you fail your test, then you would have to get your permit all over again. Then you would have to take a drug test to get your permit. So that's something new. So beware of that. Um, also, we all know about the first attempt where I was like one foot from the dock. So my second attempt, I got parallel blindside. So all I know is that in school, I was practicing in a rectangular box for about a month, okay? So I feel prepared. I go up there, ready to take my test. Just tell me, someone please tell me if I'm tripping. I'm going to show you now. Okay, right here, this is the box that I learned to park in, right? A rectangular box, okay? So when you go to the DMV, you're actually going to be trying to park in a box like this, which is a parallelogram, I guess parallel parking, whatever. They're, that's what they get away with, I don't know how. But this is how the box is going to look when you try to go in the DMV. It changes the box a lot. This slanted. So one of your tires can cross the line. You cross the line, you lose points, da 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 whatever. Um, when I was there, I saw many people fail in that spot. There were a lot of people that passed. As soon as they got to that spot, they did not make it. So... I personally think it's a way for them to make money. Um, everybody, they have their own opinions about it. Um, I study really hard, so I feel like I should have my license right now. And due to me um, not passing that portion of the test, I have to pay um, about $2,000 again just to retake a course that I already know about and you say that doesn't sound right it doesn't sound right it's not right but that's the reality i have to get my permit all over again which is about 85 to 100 dollars which means i have to take my test all over again my general general knowledge <laughs> my uh air brakes and combinations i have to take that all over again I have to get a drug test, which is $40, $50. Just a waste of money. Just piss in a cup. Um, my piss is clean, so whatever. And then, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's a waste of time. So after you get your permit, you have to go back to school again. And it's like, I feel 
feel like something's wrong with that. They should have something better, better options, um, because I've spent almost, what, I've spent about $5,852, um, trying to get my class A license. I've taken a lot of private classes and everything, so, and the private class that I took was on a box that was not the same box that I took my exam with, so. I'm just on here trying to warn people, um, be careful when you get your permit and uh, be careful what DMV you go to um, because I don't think they're wanting you to get your license. They're not on your side. As much money as they can get from you, they will. So anyways, thank you so much for watching my channel and I hope this helps you. And if you have any questions, feel free to comment and I can answer for you. So to recap that, if you have your permit and you take your test three times and you fail, you will have to retake the whole course again, which means you flunk your trucking school. Welcome to America. Have a good night. Bye-bye.